guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a double reveal for the Fire and Ice Fragrant Jewels Rare Set. I'm going to do the candle and then the bath bomb all in the same video. And I just wanted to show you the candle first, the little label. And it does kind of smell like Vicks Vapor Rub. <laughs> so we'll see what it smells like when I burn it. If it's too overwhelming, we will find out, but I will be back to show you what's inside. So the piece of jewelry is ready to come out. And as you can see, the wax went from an orange and it's now a red color. So I noticed when I had been burning it for a few hours, there was like a pool of wax that looked more melted than the rest. And whenever I touched it, I couldn't tell if it was supposed to be the, the jewelry package or not. Um, but that's what I noticed. It was red wax. So I don't think it would have blended nicely had I not put it on the warmer. Um, as you can see now that it's been on the warmer, it's all red now, except for the little part at the top where it didn't melt. But I like that it was color changing. I still think that's fun, even if it doesn't end up working exactly how it's supposed to. But let's take a look. It didn't, it did definitely smell like Vicks Vapor Rub, but it wasn't as strong as a scent as I thought it would be. So that was kind of nice. And we did get a winter code. And here is the ring. That is really pretty. So I'm gonna go ahead and enter that code and I'll be back to let you know how much it appraised for. So here's the ring. The tails kind of lock at the base of the ring and it wraps around. And then the dragon's faces are on both sides of the stone. So I think they did a really good job with this ring. I think it's beautiful. It appraised for $25 with 25 reward points. And I will show you what I got in the bath bomb. So it's a little bit difficult to tell on camera, but the bath bomb actually had little scales indented in the egg, which I thought was really cool. And as you can see, it dissolved, it fizzed super quickly. This is not sped up at all. It was just a very fast acting bath bomb. And much like the candle, there is actually a hidden color in the inside, which I was not expecting. I thought this bath bomb would just be a light and a dark blue. But you'll see here in a moment, it had a different color hidden inside. And this one smelled less like Vicks Vapor Rub. I think this bath bomb smelled more like eucalyptus. But overall, I think they both smelled okay. I know some people complained on the website, on the Facebook page, that it was too overpowering. It smelled too much like Vicks Vapor Rub. I didn't get that. Maybe I was just lucky. Maybe mine just wasn't as fragrant as theirs, but I thought it was pretty nice. And I was not expecting that pop of the orangish yellow color in the bath bomb. I just think it looks so beautiful. Unfortunately, they gave me the wrong ring size in the bath bomb. I got a size nine and in the candle I had a size six, which is my correct ring size. But this ring still kind of fits on my middle finger instead of my ring finger. So I'm okay with that. And of the two rings, I actually prefer the one that came in the candle since it's a little bit more subtle than the one that comes in the bath bomb. So here's my ring. This is incredibly detailed. The entire band of the ring has little scales on it. The wings are very detailed. They just did a very nice job with this collection. Probably one of my favorite rare sets. So let me know which ring you like. Did you like the more subtle ring that came out of the candle or did you like the bigger ring that came in the bath bomb? Leave me a comment below and let me know which one was your favorite. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.